Welcome to our Halloween special of Luigi's Mansion 3. It's it's time to game. Yeah. Alec is player one, I'm player two, I'm Gooigi. <laughs> Why are we going to multiplayer? <laughs> are there not multiple players? Yes, but this is whoa, the whoa, 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 whoa. mode. I'm I'm seeing some controversies in your I theology go here. Back. I don't want to play Luigi Mansion 3 mini games. That looks like Story Clash. Story mode. So it looks like Clash, like Clash Royale. No, the other Clash. Of clans? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is that really the two? Is Can you not think of another game with the word Clash in it? Because I can't. Let me think. Clash of Cock and Nuts. No, I, I don't know. I'm probably halfway through the episode. I will. Yeah. I love this game so much. So what's the story of this? Another. It's it's place. the exact same story as the original. The original is Luigi gets a mysterious mail in his uh, box, or a letter in his mailbox, and um, it says, "You just want a mansion for free. Come get it." Um, so the plot of this one is. Peach gets a message in the mail that says, You just won an entire hotel. Invite all your friends. Come get it. And they're falling for it. Go get it. It's so expressive in this game. I love it. Nessie's pet dog from the second game. Polter pup. Still there? Why did he not suck him up in a vacuum? Because when he tried to escape, he literally jumped out the front of the vacuum when he was sucked up. And he's nice, so why not? Stupid. I'm gonna kill that dog. His mission in his missions in two suck so bad. I'm gonna suck up Gooigi. That's me. Yeah. You shouldn't do that. Can I? I think. <laughs> oh. -ho. I can't retaliate. I can't suck up the main character who is made of mass, flesh and blood. You go in the hotel, everybody go in the hotel. Oh yeah, let's go! Do we have to rescue Princess Peach again? No, it's always Mario. We're always rescuing Mario and he's fine, it's wholesome. Come on. This is an mansion, the title lied. It did, you're right. There's not but, three of them either. It is a 15 floor hotel. True. Yay! Kind of saying the battle pass. That's what I'm saying. She must be from Dirty Docks. <laughs> what does that even mean? I have no clue. She looks like the battle pass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's not scary enough. Horror. So, uh. You're off. Why can I not run? Or can I? I don't know. I don't, I, the intro is very short. Princess Pinch. Beautiful. True. <laughs> true, Peach. True. Hey, can I skip through your dialogue, please? Per se. Ciao. Oh, it's just me. <laughs> PlayStation moment. Xbox moment. Mario. What's up? That's not Mario. Because he's wearing red? It's gotta be. Yo. The last resort road is scary. So it's the final boss. No, it's Helen Gravely. That's, that's, a, that's the final boss. That's not an evil name at all. Pass the battle pass. No, that's the, the final boss. 
<laughs> I didn't like the way that guy crashed his screen. Yeah, go get it. Huh? <laughs> Hot. Look at Luigi's <laughs> lips, bro. Oh my god. Oh, he is ugly. <laughs> Why is he lacking chin? <laughs> Luigi, what happened, bro? God damn. Let's go. Is that all Mario says? Yeah, like, has he ever said it, has he ever said anything else? We're waiting for the movie. <laughs> yeah, there's like catchphrases. I don't think I've ever heard him say anything else. Except for the end of Luigi's Mansion 1, which always makes me a little bit emotional. Because you're so used to Mario going, let's And then there's a scene where at the end of the game you save and he goes, it's my <laughs> and then Luigi actually cried. It's very, it's very emotional. Bye bye. Okay. Bye. Luigi. Peach. Luigi is the only human who doesn't use. Bye Mario. <laughs> yeah. Luigi's the only character who doesn't use their catchphrases as their oh. speech. I guess. Luigi will say anything, oh. even racist shit. Wow. Go ahead, Luigi. Demonstrate. <laughs> Your entire room is made of gold. What's in here? Porky. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for opening the same drawer. I figured times. something would happen. Ah, <laughs> blah, 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 blah. That's how you scared me today in Poker Stars. When we first started, you spun and you went like. <laughs> yeah. I was just trying to be nice. <laughs> Why are you kicking the chair? That is. Time to rest? Yeah. Whoa. It's a gun. <laughs> Wait, so that's loaded. Luigi got the strap. Yeah, he's, he's ready. He's, He's gone through two whole tricks by now, the same thing. Home get this free thing. He's ready this time. He got the strap. He will def defend his brother. This is where he reads a book and dies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love this scene. <laughs> he reads a book, nuts, and dies. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. It's time to play. When do you come in? The moment you get the vacuum. Okay. Because I'm in the vacuum. Uh. Ferocious hot peach sex. Luigi should not have heard that. Now he's afraid. Yeah, Mario is going at another room. Let's yeah. go check on that. <laughs> you guys doing okay? Yeah, you all right in here? Scared me. Ah. <laughs> Luigi has PTSD of the first mansion, and now he's constantly worried about everything. And Mario gets real pissed off whenever that happens. The common occurrence that Luigi walks in on him and Peach. Yeah, it happens. Come on, guys, in a hotel, you do realize other people sleep in those beds, right? It's gross. I don't care. <laughs> you don't care? Uh, Experience? Uh, yeah, I guess. <laughs> Resident Evil. <laughs> yeah, that's what Luigi's Mansion is, bro. It's Resident Evil, but Mario. Is there any other ones? Oh. Well, this is where Peach's room is. Well, yeah, I know that much. Peach. Hello. This is her diary. You want to read Peach's diary? Whoa. <laughs> where? What? Where are we going? You can just explore. It's in the closet. <laughs> oh no. Luigi's so scared. Let's go outside. Never mind. PTSD. Oh. <laughs> oh no. That wasn't Good thing me. my quick reaction time saved me. <laughs> Yeah, or else you'd be smelling like flowers right now. So 
someone's coming. Like, Ma Mama's coming. Peach? Mario. Oh no, it's the good guy. Whoa, Luigi checked her out. I saw where his eyes went. Luigi. Jesus Christ, Luigi. Dude, Daisy's literally like in the sports games. Daisy gets the same treatment Waluigi does. Good. She's in Super Mario Land where she came from, and that's it. It's, it's Kembo. Nah, they're teamed up. I don't think they ever elaborate on that, which kind of upsets me. They kind of elaborate how King Boo escaped from the first one. But in this one, they're like, I'm back. I'm King Boo. How did he escape from what? In, in one, the moon shattered into a thousand pieces, which was keeping the ghost tame and friendly. And that gave King Boo a chance to escape his cage. So he all the ghosts to help him get out. Huh. This one, he was like, I'm here. <laughs> Fight me. Interesting. Let's put Luigi into, into Python. Why do they want to kill everybody? It's time to run. Because Egad found the original mansion full of the ghost and King Boo and stuff. And was like, Egad, the professor. Small uh, doctor guy. You'll see him. He's in this game. Um, but he found the, the haunted mansion and was like, Hey, Lamau, I want this mansion, but there's ghosts here. So I'm going to make an invention that lets me suck them up. And then I'm going to put them on paintings and hang them in my mansion. And then the ghost escaped and Luigi had to go in and suck everybody up and put them back in their paintings. Which is why King Boo wants to put everybody in a painting because he's pissed off. So <laughs> like, you motherfuckers put me in a painting for like two months. Okay. Or Deco. Bioshock. It's also kind of like, um, it's like kind of a reference to Super Mario 64. Like, jump through the painting into a new world, but Mario is stuck in the painting. Oh no, that's ironic. No, not, not Mario. Mario. What will we do without him? Who will Yahoo Yippee? Pull through pub. Don't go in the painting. <laughs> Sounds comfy. Kinda. Those are items. I already know it. I can pick those up. Time to go pick those up. <laughs> Do it. That's also an item. Can't touch it yet. These two I can, though. Under here? Nope. Not yet. Not yet, but I can. Yep. Oh. Ah. The towels. Oh. I'm so scared of everything. I'm Luigi. Fear. <laughs> Hello? There's Polter Pop. He's adorable. Get out of here, dog. I believe if you hold B, you should be able to sprint now. Or oh, one of the buttons? No, not yet, maybe. I think there's a sprint button eventually. Hope so. This game will be really, really slow if not. Yep. Yeah. Good job. Does he do this the entire game? That's what Luigi is, he's scared of everything. Also, he doesn't have a weapon yet, so like the basic shit is pretty much scary expressive movement and then you get the vacuum and actually get to play the video game good which uh the vacuum's on your right by the way so just keep going right <laughs> good my right no right again luigi is coming to right beat again. your right ass again. wow well this looks like something you would drive i want to drive i'm trying to find a, a 30s car 
It's hard. Well, look, he found one. Whoa! Check, check the car. Oh! Oh! Vacuum. 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 Well. Spell it, Tristan. V A C U U M. <laughs> there might be two C's. But yeah, yeah, that sounds right. V A C U M. Vacuum. No. Uh, Luigi got the vacuum. Oh, wait. You don't unlock me yet because you need to unlock the vacuum upgrade. I see, so it is another Alec playthrough. <laughs> Full day. You got a whole day or what, boy? Alec? That's B! <laughs> PlayStation Boy! <laughs> I'm playing Xbox right now. Do it again. Now release. He's dead. Let me suck him up. Hello? Press the L. There you go. I want to flash him. <laughs> and then he boxes you. Because he did do what he told you to. Okay. What is that? If ghosts are surrounding you and about to beat your ass, you can use the vacuum jump to get them away from you. Yes. Okay, bye. He <laughs> <laughs> did not vibe with this world. Now you can suck up all the treasure. Things up high and stuff. The whole reason you could is because you needed your vacuum. I will kill you. I literally. Oh no, man. <laughs> it's a DM. I was gonna say I literally <laughs> muted Discord for an hour. How are they still From messaging? The Brendan. Brendan asked if I got a better time on my speed run. <laughs> no. <laughs> I messaged him when I was 23. When you were 23? Yeah. Now I am 20. You just reverse aged? No. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Suck it up. Suck that thing up. Suck him up. That's right. That's cash. Cash. Luigi gets paid. Yeah, but why can't I suck that thing in the middle of? What thing in the middle? Crystal? Yeah. Uh, I guess you can't get it yet. Unless, yeah, flashing might. No? Hmm, guess not yet. Is there anything I need in this room? Money. Moner. Mon. Mongolian grill. Please Mon get there. Mongolian? Jin. Does not like this. <laughs> Shit, Jin Saka. Jin Saka. From the game that we haven't played yet. What's <laughs> the Tsushima Jin Saka? Do not like Mongolian food. Probably not. Why not? What do the Mongols do to him? I'd like a seven page essay. <laughs> Turn in the They Friday. killed my family. Not good enough. <laughs> <laughs> That's one. That's one piece of evidence. We need three pieces of evidence, one counter evidence. And then, a, and then Counter a, evidence? Yeah, like the thing that's like, here's a downside of it. Uh, it's not, it's not a counter evidence. Evidence is, like... It's like evidence against it. Yeah, pretty much. Kind of. Like, that's what I had to do at school, was three points that sh are good and help with your claim, and then one That was three that years doesn't. ago. <laughs> three years? I learned that in sophomore. Three years ago. I'm a freshman in college. Oh, yeah, technically. Yeah, jeez. Pen. 
Flush the door. <laughs> Wrong door. No, really. You're stupid. No, I'm not. Luigi's in here or something like that. I don't remember when Luigi's unlocked. I know it's on this floor. Luigi. Luigi. Monitor. <laughs> wow. That's crazy. Who put all this money in this vending machine? Oh my god. You bought something from a vending machine? Oh, you're right. I do remember them throwing giant quarters at me. I had to dodge them so I didn't get brain damage. Yeah. <laughs> Same with chests in there. Giant gold boss. Alright, let's get out of here. You could probably sprint now. Yeah, there you go. How? Should be B. There was an item in your way. How do you get rid of it? You got this. The gears wow. in his brain are working. Yes! He's done it. He's a genius. Why are you sucking away the cash? Sucking away. Suck. I would like to to reevaluate re what you just said. Munner? Wiener. I don't even know what that is down there. That's a gem. Okay. You need Gooigi for that gem. That's a gem in the bush. Can't get it though. Start a fire in the hotel. End of game. Good I, job. Yeah, okay. That's fine. Your friends and family are dead. Okay. And? And? I'll just go home to my six mansions. Yeah, exactly. Is it Luigi's mansion? Or is it that one, guys? It's Luigi's. When you get, um, pretty much at the end of Luigi's mansion, he was like, I'm gonna build a museum and put all the ghosts in here and set it in the house. You can have the mansion. The amount of money you make from exploring the mansion, I will use to rebuild it. And then the more money you get, the better your house looks. And then in the second game, it cuts over to Luigi's house because the cannon rank is like rank C, which is pretty bad. It turns the mansion into a house because he doesn't get enough money. Um, and then the second game is about multiple mansions being haunted and how Luigi needs to get the ghost out of those. And then he gets to own those too. So Luigi has a house in five mansions. <laughs> Oh. Keep mashing it. I really like combat in this game. It's very refreshing. Like, I love one to death. But I like the slam mechanic in this. There they go. Yakuza. And they go. This and is the Yakuza. And they go. Oh, they're around you. Oh. Schmacked. You gotta touch him. There you go. And then you can keep mashing it to slam them, and if you slam them into another ghost, the other ghost will take damage. You also don't have to do a max flash to hit them. You could do a small flash. Yeah, but I don't know where they're at. What the polter pup doing? What the hell? Beat up my dog with ghosts, I do. Good job, Luigi, you're a hero. I still can sprint, though. Still no sprinting. I see that button. Nah, you stupid. Can't get it, can I? You can uh, use the jump on the door to get in. Wow. Hey, your first gem. I did it. Oh, Are there several gems for floor or something? Yeah, they're not required though. Good. Oh, yeah. Those are smash letters at the bottom there. Where? All those letters. Oh. <laughs> I thought you meant like the font. 
Damn, we eaten up all the DLC packs that should have released. Whoopsies. Now they will only make two. Watch two, though. We will not know. Even though, turn day we can do. Luigi has no clue. Yeah, but which ones? Which ones should survive and which ones shouldn't? Out of the last DLC pack. I liked all of them. Except for Min Min. She's a fun character and that's it. Otherwise, that entire like three month span worth to her reveal trailer and everything like that was lame. Huh? Yeah, but who we keeping? Who we keeping? Do we only get to keep one and lose one? We only get to keep two out of the five. Keep two? Actually, two out of the ten DLC fighters. Oh, a lot of the entire pack one and pack two? Get to keep two. Are we looking through the perspective of personal choice or the perspective of which one would be the best for Smash? Like, if they said, we we're only releasing these two characters, which would? Both. Okay, personal. I've been wanting Pancho Kazooie since I was a kid. So that. Oh, we're talking about the ones that are already in. Like, out of the ten that we already have, which ones, if they said, you can only have two of them. We are deleting all the other DLCs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Banjo. For one. Oh yeah, I was thinking of Crash. So Banjo. Zephyr. I don't know, I'm, I'm feeling Joker. I'm feeling Joker too. But I got that personal connection with the Banjo. Otherwise I would have picked Joker and Sephiroth. Yeah, I've, I've got to agree with the Sephiroth, but the Joker. Joker's awesome, I love Joker. Beep boop boop. Beep boop. Look at that. He knows how mirrors work. Mm. Got that. Yep. Got that key. Where are you at? Popping him soon. You need to save Egad. He was the one in the painting. And then he'll take you to get your upgrade. Kill him. I mean, I suck him up because he's, he's a ghost. Can't really kill him, but get get him. I like this game. Oh, never mind. It's not. No, it's not. I'm surprised. They literally were like walking up to you to sock you, and the game was like, not yet. Wait. I don't know how to turn my camera. Do you just use the joystick and go in the opposite direction the ghost are going? You don't have to turn the camera, it's usually stationary. Well, the, the way I'm facing. Oh, right stick. Just spin. I do not like that. But you could also use left stick. You can just directionalize where your movement is. Instead of just spinning in place. And you don't have to use right stick in combat to look for an opponent. You can hold A and then use left stick to look around. It's just Luigi moves, so you need to move it slightly. I see. No money. No money. So sad. Like when I'm charged up, I can't. Unless I. There might be an option you can turn on, because that was the thing people had issues with in the first one, and you can turn on what's called free look mode, which lets it so when you're holding your flashlight, you can still spin in a circle. Yeah. So I just pause and check. I'd be surprised if this third game in the series still didn't have free look mode. I grew up with the whole move with right stick while holding anything, so I'm used to it, but oh, yeah. it is a bit odd now that I think about it. Alright, you unlock the new light. Hold X. This is the light they had in 2. It was pretty cool. Is that a gold skull teller? <laughs> that is. <laughs> I guess technically, yeah. <laughs> Flash him. Just tap A. There you go. There's gold variants of every enemy, and most of the time if you just flash them, they drop money. The gold versions in Luigi's Mansion 1 were literally like essential to get the best mansion, because they would drop colored gems that went to your currency. But they were really tough. Huh. See. So now that you have that light, you can just like, go save Eged. Yeah. Ebra. Nice. Oh. 
What? I really hate this fact about Egad. Whoever voice acted Egad did the exact same lines in Luigi's Mansion 1. These, these lines is just straight from Luigi's Mansion 1. They were ported over. I guess the voice actor just doesn't want to do Egad anymore at all. That's explainable. <laughs> Why? Look at him! Luigi. <laughs> Funny Egad, look at him. Just an old ass man. Same with the second game, it's the same lines. <laughs> Except he calls you constantly in the second game, so it'll be like, start a new mission, Egad will call Suka Suka, yum yum, buru, shiruze, shit, and the mind will be like, go find ghost. <laughs> like, <laughs> Egad doesn't talk to you nearly as much in this one, thankfully. Good. In the original, it feels right, <laughs> but in this, any of the other two, it's like, you guys really couldn't call him up real quick. Listen, just, just go booga digga dip or something. And we'll put it in. Yeah. He's so is polite. Ugly. <laughs> That's an elevator. So why do we move to the second floor? We're going to the garage, baby. Next time on Luigi's Mansion 3, we're going to the garage.